Good, good rule following. That's what I think is contagious. 20 of you suggested that? This is an easy day for Grammy at the park because we just want to know how you guys are doing. Tomorrow is my... Good morning, Callie. Show me your bubbles. Kinsley. Happy morning. Bubble. It's a good morning. Bubble. Hi. Oh, this is up there. Okay. Okay, you have to do the bubble dance. Do you know what the bubble dance is? Bubble, 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 bubble dance. Okay, you can have them. Let's go. Come on, Callie. Let's go outside. We cannot do the bubbles inside. Good job, Kinsley. That's good, good rule following. <laughs> bubbles outside. Bubbles outside. Mm -hmm. It's a great morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Every single bubble went in the house, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Can I help you? Yeah. Okay. Go. My tiny, tiny, tiny little temper. We'll be right back. It's okay. Did that make you feel sad? You want to go inside? Yeah. Yeah. But you have to give me your bubbles if you're going to go inside because we don't do bubbles in the house. Some rules are just meant to be broken and some rules, you just definitely don't want to break them. Yeah. Man, this morning's been great. Get to play with the girls. Uh, get to have quiet time on a beautiful, beautiful February day. Um, Alex is sleeping. I'm grateful for what's to come. I'm grateful for the life that's inside of Alex and believing in that little miracle. Alex and I were talking. You can choose to be negative and we choose to take our situations and our frustrations and uh, the things that, that have come uh, in front of us and we have chosen every single day to stay positive regardless. Um, and so that's what I think is contagious. And the truth is that good things come from God. And the truth is that He loves us and He loves you. I'm grateful that you're here with us. I'm grateful for um, the pain that we've been through because through it we have become better people because we choose to become better people. Um, and we choose to say um, God is good in the midst of it all. And so no matter what the result in 10 days or not, um, it's going to be amazing. I really believe you guys. I really, 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 really believe that Alex is pregnant. And I really believe that this child is going to live a life um, that is beautiful. And I choose to have faith that this is absolutely working. Alex is getting ready for her shot. This is how many days past IVF transfer? One, two, three, because the day of doesn't count. So this is day three of bed rest. How last are you feeling? Day. Last day. Last day. Well, I'm like she's I'm up and moving around a little bit, but, but hang out on the chair. Yeah, very, very, just calm. We're helping her. We're serving her, and she's doing great. Really proud of her. I've got a sticker now, so I'll be right back. Oh, we're gonna sing somewhere over the rainbow. So if you were the one that suggested that, thank you. There are like twenty people that suggested that one. Twenty of you suggested that. Oh my goodness gracious! Look at that little ringlet. Go, if you didn't go get the stuff, the sand yesterday. Wall get him, wall get him. Oh, you sweet little pincushion, you. Oh, friends. It's bad. This is not good. No. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, there's a land that I heard of once in a
friends. Let's go ask Alex how she's feeling. Alex, how are your true thoughts? What are you thinking? What are you feeling? Okay, so we're back at the park again today with Grammy and we've been having so much fun. We've been sliding and climbing and doing all kinds of fun things and now we're in the sandbox so I have a couple of minutes because they're both in the sandbox together. Well, you know, Callie thinks she can do anything that Kinsley does. Well, this is how far we got so far. That's good enough. This is an easy day for Grammy at the park because look who's here with us. It's Grandpa. So I have two hands and two more hands to keep an eye on the kiddos. One can get a swing, and one can climb like a monkey. today instead I slept <laughs> so I'm excited for tomorrow tomorrow is my follow-up after the transfer acupuncture appointment as well as blood work just to make sure my hormones are like on the right track and if not they would just like change my protocol um, and that's not a pregnancy test not a pregnancy test guys we're going to the fertility doctor tomorrow and it's not a pregnancy test we have to decide when we are gonna start taking pregnancy tests if we're gonna wait we're doing blood work early this time we're doing it on day 10 instead of on day 12. Yeah, I'll bring it back. Philip's going to check on the girls so I have to say yes most clinics do not do as many days of bed rest as as our doctor does um most places are only like one or two days however that's still bed rest and I would say to the husband last time Philip kind of was a little bit just done with me asking for things and asking for food and things like that I feel like this time around he we talked about it last time of me feeling like I felt guilty like asking you for a snack and things like that when I'm, I'm not supposed to get up and so he said I'm sorry I made you feel that way and this time he was so helpful he was so he had such an amazing servant's heart it was just really sweet um, to have him like he knows like he like this is part of the process like he's helping being part of the process I this has definitely been a journey this has been I think it's I think I think um I think it's taken a lot out of us just um mentally and emotionally just knowing how much we've been through to get to this point um yeah. this is our third IVF transfer um, and we had five IUIs before that. You would only count three of those. <laughs> um, and it's been a total of just under six years of infertility. We just want to know how you guys are doing. Mm -hmm. And a, a lot of you guys don't go through infertility and are the opposite. And But you guys are on this journey with us. And what I love is that we're here all together just trying to make each other better. Um, trying to yeah. figure out how to be healthy, healthier in our families, um, how to just have better relationships. I just feel like um, I love this community. I love you guys. But specifically for those of you who are going through infertility, our hearts are with you. We are hopeful that um, that things go well for you. But you know, things didn't go perfectly well for us. Yeah. We we went through a lot, like Philip said earlier today, like you definitely get strengthened when you go through hard times. And I feel like that that's us, that's, that's us in a nutshell. Um, but I am excited for this time. I'm hopeful, I'm, I'm more optimistic. 
Last time I was tentative and it's very easy to be tentative feeling like I'm not sure if this transfer is gonna work and I put on mm -hmm. my walls to just make sure I don't feel disappointed. But yeah. you know what, this time I would rather be sobbing on the couch mm -hmm. disappointed um, because I got my hopes up so much. Mm -hmm. And I, I'm, I, that's how I just wanna be this time. I just wanna be all in. I just wanna believe it to the max that 100% it happened. And if it didn't happen, I'm gonna be shocked. You know, and that's just how we're gonna live it out this time. And and I want to say it's a blessing to watch you go through this, Alex, because mm -hmm. uh, to watch your faith increase and to see your belief not just in the process but in yourself is beautiful. And I think um, as we did in a couple of videos ago, yeah. it's inspirational watching you live this out, Alex. Um, but truly, um, leave in the comments below and let us know where you guys are at your journey. We do truly pray for you guys, like I had mentioned mm -hmm. earlier this morning. Um, you guys are constantly on our in our thoughts and we really 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 appreciate when you guys engage with us yes, and when you please. engage with each other and you encourage each other leave it in the comments below on how you guys are doing but we're gonna wrap this up and call it a night because i'm excited to get out of bed tomorrow and take a shower <laughs> i know it's okay but I hope you guys did have a wonderful day and thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog and went along with Bammy to the park. And like always, guys, go let, let your love multiply. multiply. Bye. Bye.